Hi guys, welcome back to Judy P's Crafty Journeys. Um, today I am going to show you just a small uh, thing of uh, goodies that I got from the Dollar Tree. Um, it's nothing big, I just happened to get them and I'm just going to go ahead and show them to you. And then I also have a surprise as well. Um, but when I was there, this one, there's one I need to get to because I heard that there are like, uh, there's aisles and aisles of craft stuff, but it's in a, another state where my sister lives and I need to drive over there because it's only 45 minutes away and I need to get in there and check it out because ours is very small. But I got this, uh, strip, fastener strip. It's one yard of it, um, because I like to use, um, this type of Velcro and such on different things for my journals. Uh, rather than magnets sometimes, so I got me a thing of that. Um, I also got me some more fastener dots. I do use these a lot as well. Uh, I prefer them sometimes to the magnets. Um, then I got me some cool stickers. Um, they have some really nice sayings on them. So I got that pack, and then I got these really cool uh, perfume bottles that I thought were really neat, so I got those. Um, I also have these um, mason jars. I have small, there's small ones and there is large ones. I thought those were really cool. So I got those. I got these. I absolutely love some dream catchers. I thought those were cool. So I got those. Um, here's some more of these foil stickers. This is um, some nice little wine glasses. I like those. And some of them have things on like this says smile and this one says paradise. So I got that. And then here's another one of my favorites. Um, I like these little butterflies. So I got those. And then I got these. There's a lot of birds. I love birds and butterflies. So I thought those are really pretty. I'm going to uh, use these things to make some ephemera for journals. Um, I try not to just take a sticker and stick it on something. I like to uh, put them together with other things. So, yeah. Alright, now to get to more important matters at hand. I surpassed 300 subbies and had never planned a giveaway. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a surprise giveaway. And what I did is I took the names from the last three videos that I did. And I took everybody that commented. And I have put their name on these slip of paper. I'm going to cut them up, throw them in this envelope, and I'm going to draw one. So, um, and whoever wins, I kind of want to cut these even because I don't want one to feel bigger than the other. Um, and whoever wins is going to get a little something that I have to send out. Now, when I reach 400 subbies, I will be doing a planned uh, giveaway where I will give people time to comment on a specific video and uh, do it that way. And I can tell you that the next one that I do will be a um, journal. So that will be my next giveaway once I reach the 400 subbies. So anyway, I've got everybody's name on here. And I'm just going to show you that they go in there. Uh, let's see this here so that you know. Here is the empty envelope so that you know there's nothing in there. So that everybody gets a free shot. And these are the list of the people that I am putting in. I've got Sheila Gingrich from Boho Daydreams. I have Willow Wood. I have the Wills Designs. I have Sarah Twycross. I have Sirius Hecka. I have Sherry Schmer. I have Melissa Barnes. I have Tracy Landers. I have Joyful Michelle, which is Michelle Gregory. I have the Book Vandal Shop, which is Dawn Meadows. And then I have a Julia McNeil Crafts. And last but surely not least, I have Tuesday, Tuesday Morardi. And that's my list of names of the people that can win. And I've got these almost all folded up. I'm putting them in here. I just like to, I know I could have just had them in there, but I just feel more comfortable doing this way. So you can see everything was fair. And 
that there wasn't more than just one of everybody's and everybody was in there and I'm going to shake them up and see there's my list of names guys all right and this is what one lucky person is going to win and what they are is I have these eye clips which is magnetic page markers which I thought are really cool I've used these before in my journals and I really really like them and this is what the front looks like and then the back and uh, I'm sure you guys will find some use for them they are um, like a Paris type theme with a cafe and some wine and uh, such so and then I have a pack of 10 A2 cards and envelopes for you to design and then I have this 18 pack of treat bag sets um, these are like some little tags and these are flat bags so it's really nice because let's see, there we go um, right here there's a window and I actually used one of these in one of my journals as a picture frame so and I'm sure you guys could find something wonderful to do with them as well do that or whatever else you can think of so that's the three things alright guys so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to shake this up some more Alright, mix it around off my hand, and I will draw the lucky winner, and it is, let me see who it is, it is Melissa Barnes. So Melissa, I am going to be sending these items to you. If you could PM me your address, or just let me know that you have seen this, and I can uh, send you out your goodies. So congratulations on the surprise drawing, and I thought this was a lot of fun, and you know, I just might do some more surprise drawings just because it's fun and I want to. So keep watching and look out for further surprise drawings. And don't forget to tell your friends to like, subscribe, hit the bell. And uh, once I get to 400, I will be giving away a journal, which I will reveal at that time. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. You guys have a wonderful evening. Don't forget that life is a journey. It's not a destination. All right, all my crafty buddies, have a wonderful evening. Bye.